Hello everybody and welcome to today's video. We are just following, following on from our previous video where we've shown you our puppy that we're getting and we've been and done some shopping haven't we and yeah. bought some things that we need for the puppy and we thought that we would show you them today. So we will link all of the items in the description below if you want to have a look. Most of them came from Amazon, a couple of things came from some other places. So let's get started. First I have some food bowl. A food bowl. So this came from Amazon. I like these because they've got the non-slip bit at the bottom, so it keeps it on the floor. But Pablo's got one like this in a different colour and they are quite good. Nice and easy to wash, stainless steel inside. And you chose this colour, didn't you? I think yeah. it was grape or something like that. Yeah, it's like a lighty bluish, like light blue. Kind of blue. Yeah. Okay, Tiff. Next we got a food, uh, water bowl. The water bowl. So a nice big water bowl. I think this one was 20 centimetre diameter, which doesn't actually seem that big, but actually is quite sturdy. So we've got, we have got dogs already, so we've got water bowls, haven't we? But this yeah. is just an yeah, extra got one. Two dogs. This water bowl is going to go in the kitchen. So it's grey to match with the nice new kitchen. Yeah. Right, next thing. Mia, what do you want to? Sh what have you got next? Next, we've got a play toy thing. Yeah, we have bought this sort of. Um, it's called a flip board, so you can hide treats in there, and they've got to work out how to open them, so slide things and push things and get their reward. So we thought that would be quite good, not only for the new puppy but for Pablo and Sam maybe. Pablo might like it. I don't know if Sam would be very interested, would he? Yeah. But yeah, we have to see how that goes. Next we've got trees to put in the course for trough. Yeah. So we can use these in that little activity thing or we can use these as just rewards for yeah. teaching them obedience. That one looks like a bit open, this one's not really. We open. did open it, didn't we, in that Pablo house thing? Yeah. yeah. Okay, for, and to go with it, I guess we've got this one. The clicker. The clicker. So once he does something like sit, uh, you've got to teach him how to sit. So like sit, if he does, does that, you click it and then hand over his the tree. tree. That's right. So yeah, just a little click of that. Have a look. Oh, we've got some bone toys. We've got some chewy bones. The white one is when he's older, but you can use the other two. Yeah, you can have the blue one and the middle one when he's a pup, and then when he's a bit older, you can have the white one. Yeah. So we don't chew on daddy's slippers. <laughs> right, what have you got? I have got a doggy toy. This one, a power chew. Beef flavour and yeah, it does smell of beef. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Doesn't it? Smell it? Yeah. This was oh. for small dogs. It is quite small actually, so hopefully it'll be okay. But yeah, it does stink. Long lasting power chew. Okay. Next we've got a collar. So. We've got a special collar. Now this is something new. Rather than having the tag that hangs off the collar, I'd seen that you could get these so you can have all your details engraved on the back part. So you've got a dangling tag, which I thought was quite good. But this actually came from a shop online called Tagiphony. Um, we've bought, I think Pablo's little ID tag came from there, so we've got Truff one of these. We've also got a smaller one, like so a smaller collar for when we first get him. Like a turquoise collar and a turquoise collar. A matching lead. lead, so when he's smaller, you'll have just a smaller collar before he then has his big one. And next we've got a giant bed. A giant dog bed. Yes. Which covers mummy up <laughs> and half of my hair. This is the make Bunty. It says, yeah, Bunty. And this came from Amazon as well. We had a bit of a dog bed fail with the first bed oh. we bought, didn't we? Yeah, it was to... like giant, but not with these up. They went down, but we wanted them up. So if I've still got the picture, I'll just insert a picture of what it was supposed to be and what it actually was when it came, just so you can see. 
So because of that, we had to buy another one. So it's still not great, to be honest, for a dog bed. But then I suppose you don't really pay for it. It wasn't mega expensive because he's just going to probably chew it when he's a pup. So that's the bed we've got. We've also got a nice big blanket. Up and then fluff on the inside. And then just and then blue, blue fleece. fleece on the outside. Yeah, this is very, very flat. It's very cosy and thick and fluffy and huge. Yeah. It's huge. It covers us all on the sofa. It's not actually advertised as a dog blanket because dog blankets seem to be triple the price and not as big. And we wanted a nice big blanket, didn't yeah. we? Yeah. So we've just got a normal normal Lucky. blanket. Yeah, it's nice and fluffy, isn't it? Yeah. So we have already asked the breeder what food she's going to be feeding the puppies so we can get organised and buy some ready for when he comes home. So he's got the same food. We don't want to upset his tummy. Um, so this is what he's going to be eating. Can again. Grain free dog food. And that's it, isn't it? Also, we have also got a dog cage, but I, we won't pick that up because that's too big. Yeah? Anything else you want to say? Have we forgotten anything? We're really excited for it. Really excited? How long is it to go? Two weeks. Two weeks today, isn't it? Yeah, and our little puppies just spit black for the white nose with white paws. Yeah. You excited? Yeah. Yeah, really yeah. excited. Right, we've got to put all this stuff away now. We've made a mess. Made a mess. I hope you like seeing all of our stuff that we got for our new puppy. Make sure you smash that like button. And we'll see you in our next video. Bye. Bye. Bye.